Lindsay with Emeralds and Fairy Lights and I'm so excited to show you guys the sneak peek for today. <laughs> so this one came just in time. Um, they were worried it wasn't going to make it but this one overnight it got to me like right before I needed to have this video up so <laughs> thumbs up. Yay! Um, this is such a fun one. You are not going to want to miss this one. This um, diamond painting is a Long Journey Home by Simona Candini. <gasps> oh my goodness, you guys. Who is a Wizard of Oz fan? I've dressed up as Dorothy. I can't even tell you how many like Halloweens I've done that. <laughs> I also have had a Yorkie that I've put in a basket several times. I know Toto wasn't a Yorkie. Just, I know, for those, those super fans, right? I know Toto wasn't actually a Yorkie in the films. But this one is going to be 22 inches by 22 inches or 56 centimeters by 56 centimeters. And this one is a square. So you can tell it's a square by this blue square as well as the packaging on top. Now, if you have not heard, Diamond Art Club actually did pause production on their rounds for a bit just to um, do some quality assurance on the rounds. They have started doing the rounds again, but for the next little while, you're gonna see a lot of squares. Don't think that Diamond Art Club has given up on rounds. They're just making them perfect. So, um, but this one particular one is in rounds. Of course, on your box, you do have a 10% off QR code. Now, if it's your first time purchasing, I do have an affiliate code, which is Emeralds10 for $10 off your first purchase. But if you're not a first time purchaser, there's codes everywhere. So please use one. <laughs> Never pay full price. Um, I'll show you more as we're going through the kit. Um, and so right here, you've got instructions as well as what's in your kit. So let's get in this one. There is also on your packing slip a 15% off coupon. So um, make sure to keep that or look at that. Um, it looks like we did get a new toolkit in this one. So the toolkit, um, this is the newer version and they are integrating these into their kits. However, they are phasing the older toolkits out. And so you never know, you might get a new one or you might get an old one. And not even if you see it on the sneak peek, you might not get it in the new kit. Um, I've had kits, I, I I get multiple kits and I and I I've seen it you know it's it's random every time you guys <laughs> just just letting you know, um and so um what's in your toolkit you get all of these items we'll look at them, um if you would like a comparison between the two kits I do have a video on that and I will leave that in the description below it's just a comparison video, but in your toolkit if I can get it out it's giving me grief. <laughs> Okay, I've got it. Ooh, and I got a green pen. I oh, just love the color green. But so um, you do get a pen with a squishy. Look how it's sparkle. And I love that they're different colors now. And you have like a matching squishy most of the time. Um, and so this one is a green one. How fun. Just don't know what color you're going to get. You get some baggies that are nicely contained in a bag. You can use this for excess storage or for kitting up however you want. Um, you do get some washi. Look at that pretty. It's like a pale sort of rainbow. I don't know. <laughs> what is, what is, what would you call that? I'm struggling to come up with the name for that, but it's pretty. Um, and so what you do with washi tape, if you're unaware, um, I recently just did a video, which I will link below as well, what you do with washi tape as a diamond painter and their washi tape, I have tested it, is, is really good. Um, but basically there's usually a little bit of excess glue. Um, and so you can put that washi tape around your canvas to make it prettier as well as keep the icky out of your sticky. This is a cover minder. Look, I got a purple rose pretty. And, um, what you do with this one is you basically, you can put this magnet underneath your cover or underneath your canvas, pull up your plastic cover and put this on top. This will hold your plastic cover back while you're working on the canvas and also make it look pretty. Um, you can also use washi tape to section as well. Um, you do get a skinny four and seven placer, and then you can put these in the other side of your pen. You do get some wax in a container, which is nice. This container is gonna keep your wax nice and so it doesn't dry out. You do get a tray and this one has been updated. It has a little bit of a higher 
um, wall there and then you do get a stopper as well. Now actually, I put that in the wrong way but I've been told this is the best way to put it in um, and it works great. And then you do get some tweezers. So here we got some black branded tweezers. These are sharp um, but very, very helpful. So that is your tool kit. Also in your kit, you're going to get a small sticker. You can put this on the bottom of your box or you can put it um, in your lockbook, however you want to, but this is a small sticker with the image and information. And then let's get into this kit. So that's what you want to see, right? <laughs> So, um, as of right now, they haven't shown the preview, so I don't know what the rendering looks like at all. I'm sure it'll be great because it's Diamond Art Club and they have Kate over there that's making the renderings amazing. Um, but let's get into this. Of course, they have their nice bag that you can keep. I always keep my bag to store my canvases in after um, and while, while I'm waiting to do them just because this will keep any sort of pet hairs or anything like that. I don't have pet hairs, but you know, stuff dust gets on the canvas, um, especially when there's sticky stuff like on the inside. Um, the canvas again is going to have like a soft backing. It's, it's, there is something just special about their canvases. <laughs> um, we've got our scalloped edges as well as um, this poked lining that's going to make sure that your canvas doesn't fray. I've never had that issue. And if you can see, there's that slight shimmer on the canvas that's gorgeous. And let's talk about how there's all this green that is lovely so far. Of course, you've got Do What Makes You Sparkle on the top of the canvas. I feel like the best way you can tell if a canvas is Diamond Art Club. <gasps> oh my goodness, you guys. Isn't she so cute? <laughs> And the lion already, this is looking like it's going to be so pretty. Oh my gosh. And look at that little dog. <laughs> I love it. Um, oh my goodness. Okay. I'm just going to roll this backwards. So this is a poured glue canvas. You can do this. It will not hurt your glue. If you see any wrinkling in the plastic or anything like that, that's just the cover. This will lay flat. They have a special... Um, material tarpaulin that they put in their canvases and honestly this will lay flat so easily um you know just for sakes of the unboxing I try to get it as flat as quickly as possible you do get a legend on either side of the canvas and then down here you're going to have the information it's going to let you know that this is licensed by this artist they are getting recognized they are getting paid and um what it's just you can feel rest assured that diamond art club is licensing their products um over here you do have that your canvas comes with a lifetime warranty and you have if you have any issues with your glue or your canvas or your diamonds just email them they will get back to you so fast i know i have used it. i know my family has used it and really like honestly they are so fast and helpful so i'm gonna put this canvas down and let you guys see it um in a pan view and then we'll be back Isn't it gorgeous? <laughs> so fun. There's like an event in August. I think it's Oz in Og. And I think they're doing it again this year. But this one would be so fun to do for that event. Inside your kit as well, you do get this instruction booklet that has a message from the founder. And then you do have a QR code for a video that they've produced on how to diamond paint, as well as a QR code for the VIP Facebook group. I encourage you guys to go and log on there because they, um, so much fun stuff. There's people that love diamond art just as much as you do there too. And it's a fun time. Um, right here, you have another code for um, some money off. And then you do get your drills. And of course they're labeled so that if you if you store your drills and your canvas separately, you, you know which ones go with which ones. Um, you also get a large sticker with a large picture. I love that they include this um, just because I like to look at the picture while I'm working on the canvas. <laughs> You have you can put your start and end date. 
And then it looks like up here, there are 51 colors in this kit. If you wanna take a look at the symbols, they all look good to me. And um, it looks like up here we have three ABs. So how you can know that an AB is in the kit is if the number in the color code is under 150. AB means Aurora Borealis. That means that the drills are just gonna have an extra special shine. And we'll look at that when we go through the drills, but you can always know that there'll just be a number underneath 150. And so right here, we've got three. So I'm excited to see where those go. And then these are individually cut. Um, and so it makes kitting up so easy, you guys. It's oh, this, These sticker sheets are just the best. Um, Okay, so now we are actually gonna go through the drills one by one. And if you don't like this part, feel free to skip. Um, and I will be pulling out the ABs individually. We'll go over each one and, um, let, and we'll see where they go. So let's get into the drills. Okay, getting into these drills. So we've got one straggler. Um, and this is 3815. Looks like that'll be part of the emerald, I'm guessing. <laughs> I love how they have these emerald crystals in the canvas. Um, okay, we'll start with the smallest amount of drills baggies, but we've got 648, 334. Look at those flat bottoms, you guys. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Sometimes I just like to look at the flat bottoms on these drills because they're so beautiful. We've got 754, 645. And of course, these are Diamond Art Club's new drills. They're producing their own drills. 813, 3822, 356, 168, 775, 938, 3777, 3042, 444, 844, 988. Am I only on the, the only one that obsesses over the bottoms of these drills? I seriously, like, I think they're so gorgeous. Um, 3830, 3371. I mean, the tops are, are just beautiful too, but 814, 498, and then 115. So this is our very first AB. And you guys, this is so awesome for, for Dorothy, just, you know, her red shoes. I don't know if you can see she's in this one, but we'll see where this goes. But this is definitely a red ruby color for Dorothy. And like I said, this has an AB coating on it. And it's pretty. So we'll move on to our next chain. We have got 561, 834, 433, 733, 3023, 435, two bags of that, 898, 453, 135. This is a light green yellow that they use a lot of times to highlight plants. So we'll see where that goes. That's our second AB. 3755. And then 140, this is our third AB, this blue, 3033, 647, 739, 758, 912, I love this green, <laughs> 646, 3778, and 3841. Okay, now we're going to move into the bigger packs of drills. We have got 936, two bags of 580, two bags of 935, a bag of 434, 436 with a little visitor. We've got two bags of 500, two bags of 581, 437, 3861, 165 and 744. So these are our drills. Okay, as far as the ABs go, 
um, like I was showing you guys, you've got 115, which is this red. And this one is only actually going to be right here in Dorothy's lips. So there's not going to be very many of them, but her lips are going to be so shiny. That's pretty. And of course, Dorothy needs a little bit of red on her just because, you know, her, her ruby slippers, which you don't see, but they're there, right? And then... Um, we've got number two is 135, so it's this light moss green, and number two is going to be all throughout the grass blades. It'll be like the lightest color, and it'll just shine. It'll make the grass just kind of shine, <laughs> and again, up here in the skyline, I think, basically, it's going to be all throughout the tree areas. So you're going to have lots of sparkle there and around them. And then this number three is 140. It's the blue and it's going to be in her dress. So her dress ruffles are going to be outlined in it. That'll be really pretty. And then of course up here, the top of her dress is going to be outlined in it. And then her bows are going to be outlined in it. So guys, this one is going to be so beautiful. Um, I think it's really neat. I think you could have a lot, you could do a lot of fun things. Oh my goodness, this little Yorkie's so cute. And I love how in this one, we've got like an actual lion and then we've got a scarecrow doll and a Tin Man doll with like, uh, like it looks like a Yorkie to me. I just, I'm just gonna say Yorkie because I love Yorkies. <laughs> um, but um, I think it's so cute. And then of course you've got like these emerald crystals. I love that. Um, I think those might be something fun that you could do with it. Um, but if you didn't want to take attention away, you wanted to have the focus here. Um, I think you could maybe put some, oh, there is going to be an AB in her eyes. There's going to be a little bit of this AB in her eyes, which I think will be really pretty. That will look really gorgeous in her eyes. And um, yeah, you guys, I think this is going to turn out beautiful. And one thing to note, which I just, I realized is there is no 310 in this kit. <laughs> so for you guys that don't like 310, this is a kit for you. Um, I mean, I love 310, but I love this kit regardless, whether it has 310 or not. <laughs> but just, it's one of those rare canvases that does not have 310. So let me know what you guys think. Are you guys a fan of the Wizard of Oz? Is this one that you're looking forward to? Is this one that you would like to get? Now, I um, they don't tell us if these are limited edition or not, but Diamond Art Club is trying to release more kits, but then that does mean that they need to make more kits limited edition. And so um, they don't just have their, war, their warehouse just overflowing. <laughs> Um, but I, if you would like this piece, I would log on when these are released um, and make sure you get your copy if this is one that just speaks to you. So this is going to be released on Saturday, May 14th at 9.30 a.m. Pacific Standard Time or 12.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and that will be the general release for everyone. There will be an earlier release for Diamond and Ruby tier members at 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time or 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Um, Diamond and Ruby members will have um, a half hour early to purchase these items. Diamond Art Club always does hold stock back for the general release. And so if you miss it in the Diamond and Art, the Diamond and Ruby tier um, release, you can log back on and try to get it in the general release. Um, but everybody will get a chance at this kit. Um, it is super cute and gorgeous and so fun if you love fan art and Wizard of Oz. So I will see you guys in another video and I hope you have a great day. Bye!
just feels right.